I trust Keeper Stop goalkeeper equipment because everything we do is unique. They provide a quality, unique experience. Get after it. Make sure your feet kind of get on the ground. You do a really good job of not taking your space away. So just try and make sure you get over. So boom, boom. Once his left foot touches the ground, that's when you initiate your movement. Aim for this right here, because we're just I'm taking into account that he might just take a little bit of space. So I don't want to put the cone here and then you have your jam yourself, yeah? Did I give you enough time? Yeah, I'll, yeah. Tell me, tell me. You can, you can. Biggest thing is like transition from that high, like kind of high step to low step, lower that hand, push it, just get back up and I'll try and get you right to your hands, but I'm gonna hit it really, really firm. We're past the warm up part now, so just try and get your head stable and we'll go. Yes, Good. cover, cover. Good touch. say go so it's like boom, touch and then low shot okay. and when you get back up boom, boom, here and then we go okay. just so because it's the high one you need a little bit more space to create that run <laughs> good save up oh, good save good nice hold save up oh, oh. <laughs> Good. 
All right, Jake, what did you learn? Anything about yourself you want to improve or any little technical stuff? Um, I think, to, well, not really, just like watching the video the last couple of sessions, I think I sweep a little too much instead of getting like a nice little plant into a dive. I think more often it happens in closer like range. So you don't really have the time to get a step, but that's like where the ball is going. Like every time I'm beaten, it's more often than not like past that little area that my sweep can't get into. So I think continuing to like kind of cognitively think, get a step in and go, then I think I'll be fine. All right, man, good work.